Hey, Coach Colin Castelli here with Shot Mechanics Basketball, and today I've got a treat for you. We've got Coach Tanner Hazel Baker. Um, he's an overseas pro playing in France, but he's also an elite skills trainer. Um, the reason why I brought him in is he's one of the best ball handlers I've ever met, hands down, especially his in-game handles. Um, he's not a circus handler. It's not about, you know, all this crazy cone juggling two ball stuff. Um, it's all about kind of that in-game handle where you can get from point A to point B, and he's phenomenal at it. So. He's an absolute pro about it, so I brought him in here and we're gonna run through some drills um, that's gonna tighten up your handle. All right, so today we're gonna work on a variation of the box drill. So we got four cones set up, two at the free throw lines, two at the box down there. Um, so what we're gonna do, Tanner's gonna start out at a cone at the top, and he's gonna attack dribble drive to the first cone. And he's gonna use an outside crossover. So he's crossing over left to right, moving this direction. From there, he's always gonna keep the ball in his outside hand, hitting that uh, outside crossover. So he's going left to right again. And then once you hit the cone you begin with, you're gonna hit the opposite hand. So he's gonna plan on the outside and then cross over with his right hand. Wham, we're working on that change of direction, trying to be as low and as quick and as explosive as possible. So again, he works his way back around, hitting it, hits this last one, and he's back to where he started. So again, you can start slow, work on the footwork, work on the ball control, and then once you get comfortable, you can speed it up. Now remember, when you're doing this drill, you can work on varying speeds of your crossover and changing different directions at different times. The key to a quick ankle breaking crossover is to stay low and it's all about that change of pace, change of direction. And by working in a tight box like this, it quickens up your handle, making it easier to break ankles in game. So you always want to start slow if you need to, and then once you get the drill down, you can always pick up more speed. If you want to learn more from uh, Coach Hazel Baker, go ahead and follow him on Instagram. It's at Hazel Hoops. Um, I follow him. I love his stuff. Watch it all the time. It's great for basketball motivation, ball handling stuff. Um, it's overall really, really good basketball education. So go follow him at uh, Hazel Hoops. Also, if you're new to Shot Mechanics, hit that subscribe button. We're putting out four to five videos every week, and they're going to get you better. I guarantee it. Um, the Splash Army's growing every day, and we want you to be a part of it. Also, if you're new, go ahead and click the button up here or the link in the description to get a free copy of my top three favorite shooting secrets. These are shooting secrets you can plug directly into your game and probably increase your shooting percentage overnight. So you're going to want to check those out. Um, until next time, I'm Coach Colin Castella. This is Coach Hazel Baker. Splash on.